Hey friends, it's China Guitar Skeptic, and I've got another box, which must mean we're doing another unboxing today. This is quite a special one. The Santos Martinez 450 CE, coming right up. I reached out, I reached out to my friends at JHS when I saw that they were releasing this model of guitar and I asked them if it would be okay for me to have a look and review it for you, my friends out there. And I want to make it absolutely clear before we start so that you know how impartial I am that I haven't been given this guitar, this is a loan guitar that I will give back. I'm not being paid for this demo and I get nothing out of it other than showing you, my friends out there, what I think of it, or at least I won't even say what I think of it. I'll let you do the review. So I've borrowed this to show you and I hope you like it. Let's get on with the unboxing. What a nice box this is. Uh, it's the first time I've seen a box printed up like this for a long time. This is around the 300 UK pounds, 300 and 20 UK pound mark. I'll put the exact price up here for you at the time of unboxing. Uh, it's quite handy, comes with a little carry. You could actually use this as a carry case if you wanted to, because it's uh, certainly pretty enough. And yes, this is a classical guitar. The first one I've tried on the channel. And there we go. Vintage branded, this is the warranty registration. Let's get rid of the other side of that box. Comes with a toolkit as usual. And I've really wanted to try a classical. I don't play classical guitar, but these just looked beautiful. And I thought it's bound to appeal to some of you out there that view my channel. So, oh, I can see already this is a really nice looking guitar. Let's get this bag off. Oh, the bag has split. You're seeing it before I do. So, there we go. Santos Martinez SM450CE. And there is the Santos Martinez classical guitar. And this has got a solid spruce top. It's a premium solid spruce top. And uh, the 300 pound range, it actually represents the sort of entry level for electro classical guitars. Uh, the back and the sides, and I believe the neck, are all mahogany. The gloss finish is absolutely beautiful. Straight bridge, as is the case on a lot of classical guitars. And it says in there, SM450CE, Sanchez Martinez. And I have to say the, the detailing around the sound hole is very nice. The finishing on this is great. As usual with all acoustics, you get a little bit of ripple in the top. That's, that's par for the course because of the way that they're built. And similarly, a little bit in the back, although that really looks very, very straight indeed, very flat. Lovely tuners. I love this detailing with the piece of maple in the headstock. Really, really nice pearl tuners with gold hardware. That looks really nice. And I believe it's a bone nut. It is a bone nut. It comes with the Fishman Classica 2 three band EQ. And of course, this cutaway for easy access. First of all, I'm going to mic it up through the Focusrite 8i6 using a Sennheiser 8060 microphone that Sennheiser have sent me to try out. And I'll also compare that with the MKH416 P48 that I always use. And we'll see if we can see any difference as well. So it's kind of a bit of a, a demonstration of the Focusrite and also the Sennheiser mics in the same video that you get to hear this. <music>
Of course, it wouldn't be right for us to have a Fishman on this and not to plug it in. So this is directly plugged into the Focusrite 8i6 and no effects other than a little bit of reverb added in post. Again, I'm not going to pass comment. I'm going to leave that to you in the comment section down below. I certainly um, will tell you a little bit more about it. We have got a fairly good action. It is about, I'm going to say, two and a half to three mil at the 12th fret. The appointments, it's very, very easy to play. It's got very, very nice polished frets, nice dark fretboard, not radiused. It's a flat fretboard or it's a very, very big radius, if it is radius, and it seems to have good tuning stability. I thoroughly enjoyed doing my first acoustic classical guitar review for you today. Um, it's a bit out of the ordinary for us, but there we are. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Again, I really look forward to your comments in the, in the section down below and hope that you have enjoyed it too. As always, my friends, I'll be back with more content as just as soon as I can, either on Tuesday or next Fretted Friday. And in the meantime, as always, you take really good care.